Hey guys, Sparks back with another Goddess of Victory Nikkei video, and we are going to talk about the newest cube to come out here in Nikkei, and it is called the Relic Quantum Cube. It's very cool looking, it's like this glowing orange cube, kind of reminds me of like something uh, like an Infinity Stone or something like that. It's pretty dope. And you get this from beating Lost Sector 14, which I believe you unlock after chapter 21, although I'm not 100% sure about that. I'd have to go back and look. So it does something very powerful and pretty much universally good. It will increase the fill speed of your burst gauge. This is a really powerful ability. It's gonna be pretty much universally good, right? Like you wanna be doing that in PVE and PVP, and it's also gonna be applicable to pretty much all units. Now it's probably particularly good in PVP because getting just like a slight edge and being able to burst uh, first can be a huge advantage. But um, like I said, I really don't see a downside to ever using this. Now, as far as who you wanna put it on, it's pretty universal, right? Like anybody can use this, unlike some things like hit rate and charge speed, which are a little bit more uh, class specific. This is good for anybody. However, it does increase your fill speed by a percentage, which means you're going to get a bigger increase if that unit is uh, already filling up the burst gauge very quickly. So um, units for this, obviously, that are going to be good are rocket launchers. Uh, one that really comes to mind is Senti. She is going to be really good because she already has a very fast uh, fill gauge rate as well as Jackal, and Jackal is always really good in PvP as well. So I'd say those are like two standout units for either PvP or PvE, um, but really you can use this in any situation, it's very cool. And then the second ability on it, I showed you there a second ago, is the same as all the rest of them, it just increases the strong elemental damage. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this cube and give you a quick rundown on what it does. I think it's pretty cool. I think it's going to be one of my favorite cubes to use now. Let me know if you have any questions below. Also link to my other cube review. I went over all the other cubes. Uh, if you haven't already seen that, it is in the link in the description as well as up here. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.